Okay, over all these years, and believe me, it's taken quite a long time, I've come up with five tips that'll really help you. One, use a big, sharp, thin, flexible knife to do your cutting. That way you can cut circles and everything. Keep it sharp because believe it or not, a sharp knife is safer than a dull one. The next one is, when you cut the top out of your pumpkin, cut one notch, but only one. That way you'll always know how the top fits, okay? Now the other is, don't worry if it's perfect. It's just for fun. It's having fun. That's the important thing about pumpkins, okay? Now, if you don't think you're creative and you're trying to figure out how to do a face, what I tell you to do is go look at cartoons, like in the Sunday News Sentinel paper. It's perfect, because if you notice, they know how to make faces with all different emotions with very simple lines. Happy, scary, sad, whatever. So that's a good uh, way to look at that. Okay, another thing, believe it or not, toothpicks are a pumpkin carver's best friend. If a tooth falls off, you can stick it back on, you can add a nose. There's all different kind of things. This is the sixth tip, P.S., where a big glove like I have is called a gauntlet. It's got a textured palm so you can hold the pumpkin and it, I can do this without hurting myself. You don't want to hurt yourself, okay? You want to have fun. Happy Halloween from Dr. Carvenstein.